My next guest on the cover of this year's Sports Illustrated uh, Swimsuit Edition. She can also be seen guest starring on New York Undercover, airing March 13th uh, and 20th. 13th and the 20th? Okay, on Fox, please welcome Tyra Banks. <laughs> Well, congratulations on this. Thank you so much. You know, you were just on as, as a regular old supermodel guest, what, in Vegas two weeks ago? Two weeks ago. Two weeks ago. Uh -huh. So you didn't even know. No, I didn't know. And everyone here is saying, we knew, we knew. And I'm like, how come anybody didn't tell me? No, I mean, so, so you and uh, uh, obviously a bunch of these women, you go down and you shoot all these shots. Is that yeah. how it works? Mm -hmm. And what, is there some sort of, uh, who picks? I mean, is it, is there one guy? Is it... Bob well, there's Sports one special lady sitting out there somewhere named Elaine Farley. Oh, it's a lady she picks chooses. it? Yeah. Oh, if men fair. picked it, now you knew what, if men picked it, you know what it would look like now. <laughs> oh, no, but it's a combination of like her and, and, and some of the other guys over there too. Okay, so let's say you have the small group, they pick it. And what, I mean, how do you, because I know how impossible it is to keep, the White House can't keep things secret. Yet, nobody knew this was on the cover until, I mean, obviously they print up millions of them. I mean... How <laughs> do they keep it all secret? You know, I don't know. I think that they, like, make people, like, sign. And, like, if you say something, you yeah. he's going to take you for your house, your car, your woman, and <laughs> everything. I mean, I can't think how. I don't know how to keep it secret. I didn't know. I thought uh, some other people on the cover. So when did you learn? When you, are you sitting home one day and you get a call? Yeah, I was sitting at my hotel in New York. And Elaine called me. Yeah. And she's like, um, Tyra. And I'm like, oh, yeah, you're just calling me to tell me what time the party is so we can celebrate the cover model, whoever it's going to be. And she's like... No, I'm calling because you're the cover model. And I was like, no, no way, no, what are you talking about? And she said, yeah, and I was, you know, I was kind of cool, and I hung up the phone, and I called my mom, I was like, Mommy, oh my God, oh my God, I was crying, and she started crying, and it was just tears, and just, it was ridiculous. And I made a fool of myself last night at the party. Um, one of the um, interviewers goes, Tyra, how does it feel to be the first black woman to grace the cover solo? And I was like, well, you know, I think it's great. It was, it was, it was very... And so my mom, mom was crying as well. And, my mom, and then my mom ran over and she was crying. And now, was, now, let me ask you, did you and mom have to keep that a secret at that point? Yeah, we had to keep it secret for like three days. Yeah, so and I'm sure mom was bad. real quiet about it. <laughs> well, let me ask you about some of these uh, shots in here. Now, you know, I'm looking through this. Now, this one here, this sort of a uh, rear end shot, what do we call it? Yeah. Shot taken from the back. Yeah, that, the photographer's name is Russell James. He convinced me to do that because I have this clause. It's almost like a contractual thing, but a verbal thing. Right. I don't like any shots of my butt. Like, no, no, the why? public has never seen my butt. Because it's, it's not perfect, you know. But it's not? Uh, no. It, it <laughs> <laughs> it's not. I have, like, you know, I have the cellulite. I know you know. I have it, too. And uh, if you notice, it's... it's <laughs> I do. I don't, I don't know. The light is hitting it right. You know, you, know, you might want to have your eyes checked, maybe. maybe your eyes, you know, maybe you're seeing, maybe you've got cataracts. I, I do know. I'm sorry. Well, I here's the shot. Right. I mean, I, I mean, it's a, obviously tastefully done. Nice shot. Can we show that? No, the other way. Oh, this way. Oh, here we yeah. are. I'm just lying down the beach. There it is there. There it is. Yeah. There. And that's, and you think, yeah, that, that just looks It's awful. looking really good there. <laughs> I, I have to give it to Russell. He gave, he did some justice because... You know, the only thing that bothers me in this shot is that blue thing. <laughs> You would think, oh, well, no, I and, and that's almost like a clause, like, it, that you would not... Oh, I, I don't show the booty. I do not show. Don't show the booty. <laughs> don't show the booty. I can see the attorney. <clears throat> My client does not show the booty. <laughs> no now, booty. does posing get boring? I mean, I, I mean, obviously, people think you're just down there on the beach, but it is hard work, and you got your this one. Yeah, I mean, it's hard work, I bet, you know. What do you think about it? Are you posing? Oh, well, when I'm posing, I have this thing called the ailments. And like ailments? The ailments, yeah. yeah. It's like this, the sicknesses, you know, of modeling. And like, you know, if you want to like have like a headache, you kind of, you know, do that, the headache. You know, a heartache, it's, you know, stomach ache, back ache. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a toothache. No, I don't think I have. No, do a toothache. Two yeah. Toothache. <laughs> toothache. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that looks like a toothache, yeah. <laughs> I go to my dentist's office, there's women sitting like this all day with a toothache. With a string with a thing around their head. <laughs> now, what were you thinking about, like, in this shot here? What ailment is that? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> That's a, uh, 
a, a heartache, lung ache. Lung ache. Lung ache. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's the best ad for not smoking I have ever seen. <laughs> Well, I got one. Actually, you know, I got one from your mom, which I think is a, is a great... This is one of my favorite said. shots. Show this one. There you go. <laughs> there you go. How old are you there? Three? I'm three years old. I had Afro puffs. You see my little puffs? Little 70s style. Now, are you just inundated now with guys asking you out? It's just a nightmare all the time. You know, it's so funny. I just checked my machine today, and I had 10 messages of people, like, congratulating. Right. I had four guys call three from the past and then one guy on a TV show that I've never met him he's like a, a, a famous actor or whatever oh. I got your number from a friend and uh, if you feel inclined why don't you give me a call Ooh. it's like what well, come on now you am not gonna, I'm gonna call him back but I want to have yeah. a friend call him back and pretend that she's me him. and find out who gave him my number I'm sure he's not watching <laughs> And now you're doing some acting? You got this under? Yeah. Are you like going to be like Pepper Policewoman? Can you do that thing? <laughs> oh, yeah. that's good. That's good. <laughs> and I have the hair lip. Um, no, I'm doing on New York Undercover. I play a French teacher. Oh, yeah. I, I can see that little. Yeah, that works. I play a French teacher. Yeah. So that'll become Well, I, we're very excited about you. You're always a great guy. Hey, this is great. I'm glad they picked you. You are certainly the perfect thank choice. Thank you so Tyra, much. Tyra, thank you very, very much. Thank you. We'll be right back with Gregory Popovich and his performing house cats right after this. Here, kind of.